Hey you guys, it's Linnea. I'm here today with a new video for the Be A Doll stamp set. And this is new from the Kindred Stamps February 2020 release. So actually I'm going to start off with the long hair stencil. I sprayed that with some pixie spray and I'm just going to temporarily adhere that onto some black cardstock. And now I have some gold glitz glitter gel and I'm just gonna use my stencil pal to scrape that over the top of this stencil. And you're gonna see the finished product in a minute here. It's absolutely gorgeous. I love the way all that gold glitters and shines and it has that contrasting dark black background. I think it's so, so pretty. So once my background was all done, I set that aside to dry. It doesn't take long, probably about 30 minutes, and I take so long to color that by the time I was done coloring my little doll images, my background was dry enough for me to finish off my card. So I stamped out the images from the Be A Doll stamp set. I'm gonna color in the little face with some flesh tones, and then I'm going to color the majority of this doll to be purple. My sister loves these little nesting dolls and her favorite color is purple, so I thought this would be perfect for her. Um, now I do have to say, I'm pretty sure I colored this little nesting doll incorrectly, but I really liked the way I colored it, so I just kind of went with it. I think that the little um, bow, I guess, under her chin, the little tie from her, I guess this was supposed to be a, a little hat. It should have been the same color, and I colored it completely different. And then I didn't realize that this was an apron. I thought it was just kind of a cute little accent on the front of her clothes, so I colored that whole more like a tie I colored that rather than the tie from her hat. So I just think you can color these however you want and make them your own. I definitely did. I colored a dark purple for the majority of the doll and then I brought in some blue violets to kind of accent that dark purple color. Now for my sentiment, I have some black cardstock, and I do apologize because I forgot to zoom my camera out for the stamping, but I think I pretty much stayed in the frame anyway, so you'll get the idea. I stamped with Versamark ink, and then I'm just going to heat emboss with white powder. You could definitely do gold to match the background, but I really like the look of white powder on black cardstock. I added some foam behind my little dolls here, and then I'm going to add just some liquid glue behind the foam as well. I like to do this when I'm gluing onto a textured background um, like this glitter gel. I just think that it holds on a little bit stronger and it kind of gives me that reassurance that it's not gonna go anywhere. So I'm just going to stick those onto the front and that's going to finish off this card using the new Be A Doll stamp set from the Kindred Stamps February 2020 release. Thanks guys, see you later, bye.